Okay, so very good, very good evening, sir. Hi, good evening, very good evening. Okay, so how is your day going on? Yeah, my day is going here good, quite good. Okay, just uh, tell me something more about you, where are you from and who are you, what is your occupation? Okay, so thank you for asking, sir. It's my pleasure to introduce myself. So my name is Ritik. I'm basically from Bihar, but currently living in Delhi. As far as my educational background is concerned, I'm graduate from Tilka Mani Bharat University, Bihar. And when it comes to my hobbies, so my hobbies are listening to music, singing song, reading books, and nowadays my new hobby is talking to a lovely person like you, sir. And if you ask what do I do for a living, so I run my offline institute in Delhi. The name of my offline institute is Mardarshan, and I also have a YouTube channel. The name of my YouTube channel is Mardarshan Educate, where sometimes I also upload English conversational video, and I also upload some English related content with my student. So pretty much about me, and. Yeah. Now I would love to know something about you because we know, sir, we are meeting very the first time. Yeah, yeah, right. That's great. Good to know that you are uh, uh, using so multitasking things. I think we yeah, are. That's great. So yeah, I'm introducing myself. Uh, you know the name is Garia. Uh, basically, Uttarakhand. And uh, yeah, if I talk about my education, so I did my VA, and after that, I did my hotel management. Yeah. In a this year is country of uh, Saudi Arabia. Yeah, after that, uh, yeah, I have a YouTube channel also. Where can I upload my conversation video and uh, yeah, related English uh, conversation video? And uh, if I talk about my hobby, so I'm playing to cricket and uh, listening to music and uh, here making with new people every day. Yeah, that's these are my hobbies. That's all about me. Thank you. Okay, it's very nice introduction, sir. So, what's your goal to learn English nowadays? Yeah, my goal is, you know, the is um, uh, I want to be successful about this journey. I initiative this journey and I start my this journey. So, I have not much confidence about this uh, language. So, yeah, I want to become a fluent speaker because English is very important for me if I talk about myself. So my total is the job and my work is going under by the English. That's what I'm learning here, the English. Yeah. And after that, I, I, I want to become fluent speaker. Then and after that, I just want to make help in a new beginner student and new beginner people. Yeah, these are. Okay, okay. Yes, sir. Because nowadays everyone wants to be a fluent speaker. And, and your all work has done in English. Yes, it's yes. Totally true because if you go anywhere yeah. and uh, every work is because English is official language, so every work is done in English language. So we must know about English. And it's not only about the job. If you go anywhere for an interview, okay, and now you are in job, and if you want to get promotion, that yeah. time English is, English plays a very important role. Right, right, right. English or is in promotion. Me, if I will speak very good way, and if I will communicate each other, and I will understand everything. So the my you know the company and my the client and my owner also they will also you know the uh, respect they will also understand me. They will give me like a good responsibility. Then I will handle and handle the situation. So after that will be, I think I will get a promotion and I will get yeah, something new opportunity. That's why English is very important for everyone. Yeah, me also. Yeah. Yes, sir. Definitely, sir. Uh, right. For getting promotion and yeah. miss by this, we can say English has great importance in our life because getting promotion and now don't you think, sir, English is not deciding our promotion, our status? Yes, yes. We yes. have a lot of skills, but uh, due to a lot of person who has a lot of skill, but yeah, due to lack of communication skill, they are not able to get good jobs. Right, right, right. right. Because of the community. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Communication. because they have, they know all their jobs, what they should do, because if anyone is preparing for any job so they have 
all knowledge about their jobs related, relating to jobs but right. however they should also pro proficient in english because for the communication purpose when it comes to com communication so you have if you want to communicate each other so english is very important and sir so now you are connecting from uttarakhand or you mentioned saudi arabia where are you from yeah i basically i'm from uttarakhand as you know i earlier uh, i mentioned you but currently i am living in here uh, broad country for a job purpose this country name is saudi arabia past 6 uh, year i have been working in here yeah so you are talking now from saudi arabia connecting with you from saudi arabia okay okay so what what was your experience sir yeah my experience is a good i am as a chef i am working in a five star hotel here in saudi arabia i have a lot of your experience like 15 15 year experience uh, before i had to work in another country in india also so yeah you can say good experience i am a expert i am a expert i can make uh, many kind of food like uh, you know the many types of food like uh, many cuisine indian and here arabic and uh, continental another kind of food yeah i i have a friends you can yeah. so tell me special dishes of saudi arabia yeah here if i talk about in saudi arabia cuisine here tra traditional so mostly here people are eating in the like non veg you know they they eating here like uh, non veg dishes like biryani kebab and uh, another another food also but uh, saudi arabian cuisine and uh, saudi arabian food is very different they not eat much spicy and uh, yeah, they here you uh, so is food is totally different yeah in you know, our indian food like you know the because our india people mostly eating rice and uh, chapati dal sabji here if i talk about saudi arabia so saudi arabian people eating like uh, western country food like you know the pizza burger and and we say and uh, like some fast food also and some have uh, traditional food also is yeah okay okay so what are the main festival of saudi arabia in I, just like in india diwali holi dasara okay yeah. so what are the main festival yeah saudi arabia is the one of the main festival here ramadan is going here celebrating here one month one uh, whole month here is they celebrate is ramadan you know the ramana ramadan ramadan in ramadan is a very big festival here in saudi arabia because it's totally the you know the country and they are celebrate here so sir i want to know uh, the law of saudi arabia is very strict yeah yeah here saudi arabia rule and compared and to india if you do any mistakes um, in our country there is law also but i think Uh, if you do anything wrong there there is a very strict law so what do you think sir yes yes uh, you know the our uh, india have too much population but if i talk about here saudi arabia here not much population here totally is the i think developed country here you you can see here everywhere is developed and people are also here awareness and educated people they always respect to other and uh, you know the here did not destroy to here uh, rule and regulation they always follow to here government rule and they always uh, you know they follow uh, here traffic rule and another another kind of rule but uh, here rule and regulation is totally strict nobody will be do here any wrong uh, wrong things any an illegal things because here uh, go government will give a, like you know the uh, like very you can say very like uh, punishment that's why people are scared and here you know they have fear and they are not doing here any wrong things if i talk about our india so i think our india also nowadays quite good but there are much population the not control i think the population that's why they are they are destroy our rule and regulation but here totally is good because here every person is like like i like you know they totally are good and developed country yeah okay okay so how long have you been living there sir yeah i am living here uh, after i think uh, 2019 i that, that that time i came here i think 6 year i 5 6 year i i am working here yeah i i have been working here 5 6 so after 
how many days you visit india yeah usually you know that i go vacation i think india every year every year but sometime i also i, I have go also like uh, uh, some years and some years yes i go every year so is there any special process to go saudi arabia any special visa no 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 it's, or it's a normal visa or, it, or it's a very difficult to get visa if you any wants to go like saudi arabia mm -hmm. so is for getting visa from there is easy or it's some difficult no here if uh, it's not uh, here any the specific but if somebody want to come here in saudi arabia so i think he should have to apply from there have so many offices and uh, like a consultation is nowadays in india delhi mumbai so you he, you are you you can uh, come through the like here uh, the offices and see yeah, but uh, here is i think uh, not uh, possible to here uh, if you want to directly and like like you can uh, come also here uh, if you have good reference and uh, like you have like a uh, good uh, someone are working here your friend and your brother so you can uh, come here by through also but uh, mostly here uh, you can uh, directly i think uh, from the consultancy yeah as well as you know that i am came here also like that i have also try to my give my interview there in the mumbai that time after that i am selecting here and after that i came in here saudi arabia yeah okay so sir what is the currency value of saudi arabia yeah saudi arabia currency name is uh, real here uh, real currency yeah. so what is the value in respect to the with respect to our indian currency rupees means yeah. one riyal is how much indian currency yes 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 yeah nowadays one real is going in our india like uh, 20 21 22 rupees one saudi real is uh, in india 22 rupees yeah oh miss currency of saudi arabia is powerful than india yes yes it powerful is uh, you know that that's why many people want to come here job because you will get here like good salary and yeah uh, good facility every here not only and sir i also want to know one thing uh, in india we know sir we work here like in a week we all the uh, government officers work like six days or what is the process of their working means they work for six days five days so what is the working days there yeah here working process is you know the here i think here the weekly start is here from sunday because our india is the sunday is the uh, uh, holiday that our offices and all government sector is closed but here uh, the here you know saudi arabia is the here friday friday and saturday here totally is the off day that time we get here off and uh, yeah, here also same process like eight hour duty and uh, yeah everywhere like uh, every bank and offices and corporate sector and they are doing here eight hour duty is uh, same Uh, uh, Sunday is here start. I think the weekly first we can start here from Sunday, and Friday Saturday we get here off. That time we cannot go uh, the duty. Yeah, that time is all office bank and uh, yeah um, close here. Okay, okay. Just like in India, sometimes Saturday and Sunday off are off, and there Friday and Saturday are off. Yes, yes, yes. Here uh, Friday and Saturday. Yes, sir. Off. What is the local language of Saudi Arabia? Uh, Saudi Arabia local language is Arabic. It's uh, all over uh, the you know the all, not only just Saudi Arabia. If I talk about all over Middle East, uh, all over Gulf country like uh, Qatar, UAE, Bahrain, and uh, Oman, like Lebanon, they all countries same language is Arabic language. They can understand uh, five and four. I don't know how many countries they in uh, all over Gulf uh, country, but there are same language like Arabic language. They speak okay. same language. Yeah. So, do you understand Arabic, sir, or uh, do you manage to talk them in uh, only in English? Yeah, to be honestly, I am not understand the Arabic language. Some word I think I uh, word I understand only just two three word. But mostly we talk here and just uh, we communicate here only just English language. That's why. Uh, but I don't understand here uh, local uh, Arabic language because it's uh, too complicated and it's too hard. I'm not. Uh, able to understand this what they are saying yes yes sir arabic language is hard sir yeah 
Yeah, it's too different and learning is easy, easy. But learning Arabic is not so easy. Yes, yes, learning and speaking and writing is totally different. It's not like our uh, Hindi language because Hindi, I think, I think it, it's more difficult than Urdu also. Yes, 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 right. Uh, here, uh, Saudi Arabia, here mostly people are speaking Arabic language first and uh, some people are speaking English, English also. But nowadays, I think uh, everywhere, uh, mostly people are uh, speaking English here easily because uh, here uh, so many country people are working here. You know, like uh, all over the world, people are working here, even India and uh, another country, Sri Lanka, Nepal, China, many more countries are working. But they are, how come they will communicate each other? Because they are working each together. So they, they, that's why they have to speak English anyhow, yeah. That's why, that's why me also getting this, uh, sometime me also facing this uh, problem. And uh, you know that that's why me also learning here English. Yeah. Okay, yes, sir. Because if, you must... I speak English here, maybe they, you know that I will, I will not expectation more here with my life because they will not understand me. They will not give me like a responsibility and they will not, uh, uh, you know, the uh, give me like, uh, they will not uh, love me. So that's why I'm learning here English because English is uh, very important everywhere, I think, uh, nowadays. Definitely, sir. Not only for this sport, because you mentioned people from different country work there. So if you don't know the English, so how can you communicate with that people? Because anyone from China, they know yeah. Chinese, or you know Hindi. So how can you communicate them? Any from the Sri Lanka, they know another language. So it's very necessary for you because right. you have to speak all the thing in English because you can't speak in English. You right. only speak anyone, anyone with India, then you can speak. Otherwise, right. we can't speak anyone to in other language you you definitely have to speak only in english yeah that's why you know the many people here are suffering about the english language and uh, that's me also that's after that you know i decided i have to learn i have to speak english after you know that after that i have to watch so many video on you know, youtube and i am also inspired there and motivated from youtube yeah but i have still i have not much, much good confidence about english but it's, uh, i know it's to take time and after maybe next year, I will get a good result. I, after um, next year, maybe the outcome will be good for my favor. Yeah. But because I am here. Yes, definitely. Any language is only, sir, about practice. The more you practice, the more you improve. So okay. I think this is good news. It's a nice talking with you, sir. You are also speaking very fantastic. So you are living in currently in Delhi. Tell me something. Yes, sir. I'm living in Delhi. And I'm running my offline institute in Delhi. But I'm basically from Bihar. Uh, you are basically from, from Bihar, yeah, that's great, yeah. B many people is uh, the speaking with me from Bihar also before. Yeah, they are speaking very good, yes. Yes, so, sir. Okay, it's a nice conversation with, with you, sir. And I also learned a lot of things from you. And thank right. you very much, sir. Bye bye, we will connect again. Okay, next time I will message and call okay. you. So you are there. So bye bye, good night and take care. Jai Sri Ram. Jai Sri Ram, thank you, sir.